Hello everybody and welcome to a new Minecraft series. This time we're going to be making this series because I now have a headset and stuff at my dad's house. So I'm going to be putting out YouTube videos twice as fast. We're going to be doing a, this is going to be hostile hostilities. Um, we're going to be doing every super hostile map in order except for Spellbound because we've already tried it. And uh, th for the first one we're doing Sea of Flame. Don't let touch push plates. Alright, so here we are on the Sea of Flame original island. As it says on the sign over here, I think. Uh, Classic Island, that's what it says, okay. And uh, this is a painterly pack, especially modified for this. It says, um, rules, find and complete the victory monument. Find the wool in the chest, do not use sheep or dies. Usually it's easy, difficulty, never peaceful. Um, uh, normal. You don't leave the map boundaries, so have anything you think of, and you craft the metal box for the monument. And no cheating for this. This is an open world style map. As you explore, you will find areas and dungeons. Good luck and try not to fall in the lava. Thank you. Your first goal should be to secure noble wood and also find the victory monument. It may be convenient to set up your base at the victory monument. Uh, suppress no one, see if I am blah blah blah. Uh, so, yeah, the original first three maps, they were pure survival goal or anything. Like all those survival maps, you just kind of derped around. It wasn't until my fourth map, Kaizo Caverns, I added the victory monument system. I went back and added Wool's NVM to the first three maps, but was not the best thing really. They were not quite designed for that kind of gameplay, so I'm remaking them in proper complete the monument maps. This is remake of the old Sea of Flame, blah blah blah, forum, blah blah blah, blah blah blah. Okay. <coughs> so I'm sure everyone remembers when me and my sister tried to do this and we failed. This is still need battle sign. Signs and mantans. Um, so first things first, as always, you want to have some placeable blocks that do not fall, so you want to, uh, he, he puts a lot of these little holes around the area, and, um, I'm sorry for any sniffling, but my nose is a bit stuffed up, because allergies, it is the allergy season. I don't know where any of you guys live, but I live out here in California, and it is summer, springy, and pretty. So, get some of those, and then get some placeable blocks. Not much, but you know, never hurts. And all the subsidian, I didn't want the lava one because I just looked ugly. This looks a whole lot better. The purple might look nice, but oh well, dark. It's gonna be dark, it's gonna stay dark. And uh, we don't want to upset the gravel. And there is a couple of stupid skelly spawners. I jump this. And here's the monument. Let's remove some of this gravel. And I will read those signs over there. Over there. For you. Because, you know what? You are all going to love it. Or at least anyone who's watched um, Zisto. I oh, just seem to get a saying dirty jerk. But anyone who's watched Zisto will love those signs because out here in the distance, here I'll let me up my render distance for a few seconds. Here, I'll just let that load for a minute. Err, load. <laughs> oh, that way. I want to see the piggy temple. Uh huh. There it is. This is a uh, temple that the Stowe created. It was totally underground inside one of the gigantic caverns on the original Sea Flame, I believe. Oh look, there's a dungeon over there. Oh, weird. But he worked on it for ages. And there's the pig, the big old pig, piggy temple. So yeah, let I'm going to not bore you with collecting all the wood and I shall go and um, make my way to the victory monument which I know because I've already tried this with my sister and we failed at the map so I'm um, oh, I forgot a scaly spawner <laughs> he's so evil he's eviler than evil 
Oh, Vex, we hate you. Okay, it's, um, I just clicked all the wood, it's becoming nighttime, that's not good. Um, let's get to the victory monument, set up a base, and then we shall come back. And I'll show everyone around the map. Uh, eh, it's so cramped. Get through, stupid spiderwebs, I hate you. Here's a rail line that leads to the monument. <laughs> I hate them so much. Okay. I got some wood. I'm gonna have to get some dirt soon as well. I hear you, zombie. Shut up. There's the lava ocean, and here is the rail line. I don't think anything can spawn on here. If something could, that kind of suck. Here we are at the V Monument. Arcane Runes, okay. Here's my Golden Sword. And Zestonian Battle Sign Level 2. Always one of those. And Potions, okay. Before we do anything, I need to go and flick a switch. There's a monument. I'll show you this area in a minute. Um, over here. See how it's dark? Watch this. Lumen high. Epic. <laughs> Enderman with ties. I love my tie Endermans. There. Now, I don't think anything can spawn just had to deal with this guy. Um. Oh, I fooled you. Now. Ha ha. Call me pro. Okay. So now this area is lit, and we have our farm here with the mushrooms. We got this rail line. One leads to Zathir one to Cathedral of the Suede crafting table and random rail line junk. I'm going to take this. Um, this leads to Walton Deaths. That's to the suede, right? Down. It's going that way, so Cathedral of the Suede. And flick, and okay. Urgh. I forgot. Shoot. Um, I fix it, I fix it. Yeah. Okay, fixed. Okay. Thank you. Sorry about that. Okay. Yeah. Sorry about that. That was my dad. He wants me to wash the dishes. I hate doing it. Oh well. Can I have like five minutes? Can I have like five minutes? Okay, thank you. Alright. Enjoy your piston doors is not a trap. This is an Romac hard. Okay. And enchanting table. And potions and nether wart. Random house junk. And a big empty chest. Let's go. Put this in here. I'm gonna have to i I'm gonna have to organize everything. Which I will in um, before next video, but that's the V monument. Michael, ugh, my cat is in my lap and he keeps trying to chew on the stupid um, cable for my headset. Here is the V monument. I have no clue what these things mean. Uh, this is what the victory monument looks like every time. It looks pretty nice. Always like the victory monument. All the different walls. Looks really nice. He really added himself with this area. Uh, but that's the Victory Monument and the new series. We shall be going and collecting coal in a whole lot in a bit. Just um, let me organize some of this junk and we shall be back. So
soon. So thank you for watching and have